Hey, Rhonda, good morning to you. So we're live inside of the Verculin building in Macomb County, which is just across the street from the Macomb County Jail, just to give you an idea. Normally, this building is set aside for community mental health services, veteran services, the WIC program. But right now, they have transformed the majority of it into these giant waiting lines. And this is just one of them. So you've got stanchions set up here, and then you've basically got phases of testing and then forms, and then you've got more and more stanchions. On the other side of these walls, are those ultra fissures you've been hearing about to keep those vaccines at those ridiculously low temperatures. The first round of people that you look like you heard will be those EMS workers. They will be here in the middle of the week or the end of the week to get their vaccinations. About a month ago, Macomb County received its first freezer. Now there are several more capable of keeping the vaccine on ice until they are ready to thaw. These freezers are essential for the storage and handling of the Pfizer product that has to be maintained at you know negative 70 to 80 degrees Celsius, handled very carefully, and is, it is a vaccine that has to be um, reconstituted and used within a certain amount of time once it's thawed. Area hospitals will be getting their own doses and will start vaccinating their own employees. Macomb County will receive about 2,000 vaccines in this first round, 1,800 of them are going to the county's EMS workers. But County Executive Mark Hackle says it is voluntary and probably will not be given to all the EMS workers or all the hospital staff at once. I don't think even the healthcare professionals are looking to vaccinate all of the people in their hospitals all within the same uh, day, week, uh, because of the concerns that might happen if somebody starts getting some symptoms from uh, you know, I guess if you will, having that vaccine. Yesterday morning, there was a lot of excitement seeing this vaccine packaged up, surrounded by dry ice and loaded to leave. But health and local leaders are reminding the general population to ease that excitement. Again, the first doses are for frontline workers only. And right now, this isn't the time for the general population. We have been told by the federal government, as well as by the state, the first tier is specific to EMS workers. And again, those EMS workers will be lining up right here to get their vaccinations. But as you heard, probably not all at once. Now, Macomb County, again, the freezers are in this building and they're going to get their shipment of the vaccines. But they're also going to go ahead and house those for St. Clair, Sanilac and Lapeer counties as well until those counties are ready to receive them because there is a very short and interesting timeline here. They've got to be handled very specifically because if they thaw too quickly or are left out for too long, Everard, what happens is those doses then spoil. And certainly that's not what we want to have happen here. We're live in Mount Clemens. Nick Planacelli, Local 4 News today. Not at all. Nick, thank you so much for the update.